That was one long ass night. I've heard non stop zombies all night, but it seems to have gone a little bit quieter now. And I'm just hoping that they've all fallen down and decided to move out of the desert, out of Nevada, and decided they want to be a bit more by the water. Fifteen point three per cent the old infection. Still got spider zombies here. Now, I like the look of this corridor. It's, it's quite nice and narrow. We run back there, put down Mr. T if we need to. Oh, we're still not even on the roof. Anybody in here? Say, so, I don't know. Can't read that, can't do that. Luckily it's given us our chance for our health to recover. Um I saw nitrate powder in here, we don't need that. Yep, we'll drink you. Okay, so we've got a bedroom up here, like like you do. Ooh. Okay, extended mag. Now this is what we needed, a timer relay. This is what I was talking about, doing the lights on top of the house. And we've got a generator now, so... Oh, it's an ensuite as well. But on the whole, we're... um. We can actually do that now, because we have a generator... We have the electric time relays. I did see him. It's another spider. Right. Are you going to allow me to shoot through this block? Because that looks like bulletproof glass. Get my bolt back. More sleepers. Oh, well, that was one way to kill a spider. Edgar. There's another spider somewhere, I can hear him. There he is. There you go, mid-air shot. Oh, where did you sneak up from? Tuna. Right, we'll leave the first aid bandage for the second. Is this where we're meant to be going? No, just an ammo pile. 7.62. So where's the light? Ah, oh, there's the... Oh my god, are you serious? Game, have you seen how bad I am at stuff like this? I hear a lot of zombies.
Our points looking too. The one into strength. I think we're going to need to be as strong as possible to um, withstand this. Like popping pills. Shut that door. No antibiotic. Game, why do you do me like this? Right, so that's not the way to go. So probably through here, this staircase. Yep, it's going to let us go up. Hats off to whoever designed this place, because... Fair play to you. Right. You reloaded. You're reloaded. And you're reloaded. I don't want to go out guns blazing because I don't want to wake everybody up. I can get away with just waking a few people up or shooting them like that. Right, what do we reckon about these? They're all white. Get in, Mr. T. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Right. Oh, I see another one. There we go. No. <laughs> what? Yeah. Right. What do we reckon? In here? Right, our first irradiated zombie. I don't think we've seen one yet. Now, where's my rad remover? Oh, I've just wasted a repair kit. But that's okay. Rad remover, in you go. <laughs> Every time you change a mod. Time for everybody to wake up. Here they come. Make sure we tag each one. Well, that takes some concentration for me. You guys know I'm not the best shot in the world. Just imagine if you had to do this as a quest. No wonder they never made it as a quest. Come on, anybody else that's up here? I'd rather fight you in the open.
Here is a spider. I think we just killed that. Heavy sleepers, this lot. They can sleep through anything. I'm assuming we're about clear. We want any more of that aloe vera? Yeah, we'll use that. There we go. We've got to be clear the amount of noise we've made over here. Where do we go? Well, we've made it to the roof. We're at the top. The loot up there. Now, I do remember, I do recall something about a room that you fell down into and there being a lot of loot in there, but I don't know if that's the final loot. Oh. Let's not mess about, shall we? duffel bag are you serious so how we're doing guys back at the top of dishong tower now i finished the recording the other day you're right i've seen all your comments um we were a bit foolish to think we were going to do it in one day we did have to stay overnight and do this last little bit so i'm recording this a couple of days on because i got to the top here and I couldn't find the final loot. I was expecting it to be in a corner or somewhere around here. So I actually had to do some research myself. But I now know where it is. So I went back downstairs. I've emptied out as much as I could for now. And the final loot is down here. So you can fall down onto some mattresses. Um, we knock this out. I don't believe there's any zombies in here, but we better double check. That fully loaded. And then look how much stuff is in here. No, so it doesn't look like there's any zombies in here. But look how much stuff. So we got medical supplies. Loads and loads of medical supplies. So it's a good job I emptied my inventory, wasn't it? Then nitrate will not be the main thing we'll be keeping. What we got here? Shipping crate, hidden stash. Oh. Nice load of ammo. Right. Look at this. Now, to be fair, we deserve something like this because this POI is massive. It is easily the biggest in the game i don't think i've seen anything to be honest it's probably even double the size 
of some of the level five ones, like the factories. Right, it's just um, I'm gonna read that. Is that worth any money? Yeah, okay, we'll keep hold of it for the second. What have we got here then? So we got small ammo pile. And right, let's do this properly. Put my lucky looter goggles on. Go a bit more food. Weapons bag. Okay, okay. What have we got here? Large ammo pile. Okay, we've got a few more mods. Reinforced chest. Okay, level 4 AK. That's not too bad. Not too bad. Brass knuckles. We will scrap. We'll scrap that. We're probably going to sell that. We'll scrap the helmet. Keep hold of the rest. What have we got up here? Got another weapons bag. Okay. Scrap those up in a second. Oh. Another ammo pile. So they know how much ammo you would like to use to go through this place. So they've certainly certainly given back. Right, so we've got this suitcase. Okay, we're gonna have to take it for the second, and then we've got this big massive chest over there so let's grab that let's get our oh we've actually got some lock picks haven't we so not bad at all not bad at all two lock picks and what have we got in here we've got some molotovs we've got the hunters mod we've actually got a baseball pat so we're definitely going to be scrapping that for the parts we got three diamonds, which is great, so we can maybe make that um, diamond tip mod if we if we so wish. Um, we're gonna have to make a little bit more room in here. Scrap, scrap, and scrap that when we can. Right. Uh, rocket launcher parts. Not overly fussed about that. Leather leg armor. We have got plenty of stuff here to sell to the trader. Can we fit all of that in? Look at that. So, on the whole, pretty good. So, there would have been... If we did try to break in here, we'd have had these iron bars to go through. Uh, yeah. They're not too bad, actually. 2,000 each. If I'd known that, I probably wouldn't have bothered with the... Um, going up to the roof. No, no I, w I wanted to go up to the roof. Because um, I'd never been up there myself. Show you guys what was up there. Scrap a bit more of this down. But that is the way I'm going to go out. Um, so our infection's at 21.2%. I'm going to... What's the wall? Uh, 2,500. So what I'm going to do is... It's nice and early. It's only 10 o'clock in the morning. Because we did have to stay overnight. Um, I'm going to clean out my inventory as much as I can, and then I'm going to actually... Oh, I still hear some zombies. Okay. Taking one of your arms off. All right, let's take your knee out. There we go. Now, if we get that back in here. So it wasn't obvious at all where it was. Not in the slightest. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, like I say, clean out my inventory. Um, and then I'm going to dig up some of the resources on the way back down and then I try not to get myself killed I'm not quite sure where these people have come from um, yeah try not to get myself killed in the process because that would be quite gutting now and um, I'll see you guys 
back at our home base. Hey, look at this, guys. We've got the Fates Motel over here. So I'm actually going to mark that on the map. I'm not sure if any of you guys have watched um, the TV series, but it's, um, they've done a really good job on that, so we will be going through that at some point. Ooh. So there we go, guys. Back out of the home base. That took 40% of our gas just to get back home. It's actually quite a quite a distance. Now, I did do... I got bored of digging up cement and cobblestone. We've got 1,300 there. What I'm going to do... In fact, I'll keep the food on me. I'm just going to lob a load of this stuff in here for the second... And I'll sort this out off camera tonight. Um, I'm going to keep the AK on me. Yeah, I probably will. Um, I found a few other places in there to loot. Um, found myself a structural brace, which was nice. And a few other bits and bobs. But um, they were just rooms hidden behind. Just hidden behind, like, the... Um, cobblestone and cement just like a hidden room but all it was was more zombies in there as you can see my health's gone down a little bit that reminds me let's take an antibiotic um i think that i don't know how much an antibiotic actually does let's let's double check quickly 25 percent oh damn it so we we'll use one of those and we've got plenty of honey on the on the bike and i'm pretty sure this stuff stacks so i'm pretty sure i can do do that honey does five percent uh cure infection five percent i'm pretty sure that stacks so that should do us we've got loads of splints we've got loads of stuff here um but let's go and um let's go and do something today because i saw the time was getting later and later um i want to go to uh, where are we? We're here. I want to go over here. Because there's a bear den over here, which we couldn't go through um, at the beginning of the game. As it does contain a few bears in it, and we were definitely not strong enough for that. So here we go, just over here. And what I don't understand with this game, especially in Nav's, in Nav's game, the map, they know the map. Um is why it hasn't given these as a quest. I've had these as quests in random gen loads and loads of times. Why have they not done it here? Let's make a bit of a racket. Come on out, people. Do a few of these chairs. Yeah, that's it. Over you come. So why haven't they given this as a quest? We've got the... Um, What should we call it over there as well? The um, pawn shop as well. That's a quest. So there's no reason why they couldn't have given those quests. We're already up to level 5 quests with the traders. Um, why haven't they been given these as like level... I think this is a level 3 quest, I'm pretty sure. Come on over you. What are you, what are you playing at? There you go. You lost your leg. So I'm not quite sure why they didn't bother giving these as quests, because I, I purposely left these buildings, or definitely this one, so we could actually go through it just as a quest when we are actually got strong enough. But um, never mind, we'll go through it anyway. Come on, break out, people. Why are you doing this? Oh, we've got a working chemistry station. Come on, people, work your way out. There we go. I don't know why a few here hitting the, hitting the ground. Let's 
a good POI. I like this. So, was the um, Dishong Tower worth it? Um... There was a lot of loot at the end, but it wasn't amazing. Um, it definitely didn't give me back all the, the amount of ammo and the amount of bullets we used to go through it, but it was nice to go through it. Like I say, it is massive. It is definitely the biggest in the game. Um, and to be fair, we didn't get any any real amount of lag either, which was good. Where is this spider zombie? There you are. After playing Darkness Falls, spider zombies really scare me now because there's real spiders in the game. And I'm not a big fan of spiders. Be waving at us. Oh, we got a... I want to give up on our medical cabinet. Not that we want any of that anyway. Right, what have we got going on out here? Another spider? Don't you jump at me? Now, to um, quick, easy, quick, easy little trick with this place is through here, which is only that door, there's... Oh, I've never seen that before. Uh, is the final loot behind there, which is... Um, makes it nice and easy to get to the final loot so that sometimes, especially in random gem, when you find a few of these in the world... Um, I have purposely just come up here, grab the final loot, and bug it off you and just nerd pole up here at the back and then move on. But we're going to go through it the proper way. Just in case you guys haven't seen this place before, I'm sure many of you have. Um, there will be a vulture or two probably up here. There, I can see two straight away. Work on these two before anything else. And how about you? And a loot bag. Thank you very much. So, can we make those steel bolts yet? No, we still need that ranger's guidebook. Still need that book. Which is um, very unfortunate. Oh, we've got a grenade in there. Right. Have a plug over here. It's going to take forever for that infection to go down. And this is where you're meant to go. Drop down into here. And you've got... Two bears just over there. Um, now I'm going to use my crossbow. Right, it's got rid of you. There is a couple of zombies in there as well. Let's make sure our AK is loaded. Yes, it is. And we've woken the bears up. Get ourselves down into here. Now this is the room that I was talking about that you could go through. And that's how you kill two bears. Now I didn't actually bring my knife with me. But they are zombie bears so... We wouldn't have got much stuff we would have wanted from there. Was there anybody else in here? No. So, just the one zombie by the looks of it. Let's see if there's anything here worth grabbing as we are here.
So it's not the biggest POI in the world, but it's um it's quite unique. I like it. It's definitely no Dishong Tower. Then, like I say, there's nothing that big in the game. Like I say, I didn't get any lag issues in there. Um, I don't know if they've taken zombies out of there because I know Alpha 18, there's a lot less zombies than there were. Just out and about in the world. Right. Ammo pile. Thank you. And here we go. Final loot. So what have we got here? Helmet light mod and another Mr. T. Some rounds. And loads of drinks. And once again, I'm terrible at this, aren't I? Wear that. Have a drink. Right, at least we'll get it for these main ones. Okay, so level five junk turret. That's actually better than the one we've got. That's doing 16 range damage. This one is doing 19, but it's got two mods in it. So let's just have a quick look. They're actually the same. So we're better off um, with this one because it's got an extra modifying slot. And the durability will last longer. So thank you very much, Mr. T1. We're now going to replace you now. Can the polymer string mod, can that go onto my crossbow? Modify. Yes, it can. So that's doing 56. Now up to 64 extra damage. So that's a, that's a nice find. It's a really nice find. So we're going to read you quickly. And let's get ourselves into these two crates. Okay, a few repair kits. We've got ourselves a nice meat shoe. So I think wearing the goggles does help. Um, it would help if I actually put them on at the right times. But um, plenty of chairs in this place. Let's scrap those up. Ooh. There we go. And there we go. Nice and easy. We'll knock out the front doors. Just to, oh, we've got barbed wire there now. There we go. Now, well, I know we did Aldo's cabinets. I think the bakery was one of the first ones we did, and we went through that. So that is all of the quests. All of the buildings, sorry. I think Bell's Bakery was the only one we went through as an actual quest. Um, all of those four done. So as we're here, let's um, jump ourselves into the trader. We've got plenty of stuff I want to sell to him. Sell the leg armor. Let's jump on in here. I don't believe we've got anything to hand back into him. Here is your reward. Oh, so we've got to um, kill some cheerleaders. That was one of the ones I started and drove off. We must have completed that, probably in the Dishong Tower. Right, do you have any jobs? No. Right. Let's sell him some of this. 483. 977 jukes. That's not bad going at all. We're going to sell you that. Iron leg armor. I've decided... I want to, we need to really sort out some armor. I want to go for a full steel armor. Just be like the Terminator. But he hasn't actually got anything there for sale, which is unfortunate. Hobo stew recipe. Hunter's guide. Gyrocopter chassis. So there's only the recipe there, really. Which is unfortunate. Right, let's just have a quick look at his jobs. Be with you, um, friend. What did I take as a job from you? Can I remember?
what have we got here? Got the factory, the hospital, factory one, factory two, and we've got the church. No, I don't. It doesn't. Does it actually tell you? It doesn't actually tell you which person you actually got that from. So they've actually got all these tier fives. They're actually saying are a medium. Which I wouldn't quite say that was a medium, but to rally point. Okay, we'll just leave the jobs. As we are for the second I think we are going to have to start looking at putting some points uh, into better barter, get our, um, get the stash better, I think. Is it this one? Are the best deals. Yeah, and better loot in the secret stash. So we are going to have to get ourselves up here. We've got one point available at the moment. What is going on out here? Will you be quiet? Jesus. Try and have a conversation with these people. Yeah, so it doesn't actually tell us who you got the quest from, which is a, a little bit annoying, so I don't really want to delete one and then realize it was the wrong person then have to try and go back to all the different traders to get more quests um but we will look at one of the tier five quests soon and like we will go through the cracker book as, as soon as i can get that as a quest back again um a because i want all the books and b because the bloody recording didn't um didn't work for us um but that is pretty much where I'm going to leave this one for you. I just wanted to show you the end of Dishong Tower. We quickly ran through um, the Bear Dem. I've got loads and loads of sorting out to do up here. In fact, how much? How are we doing for Dukes? Twenty-three and a half thousand. Now that we actually have the generator, um, we've got load of stuff it, we had had more stuff we could have sold to him um now that we actually have the generator we can actually start look at putting power into the um into the base which will be pretty cool um and tomorrow is the day 21 horde so yeah better get myself pretty much sorted out get our infection down that's going to take a bit of time and did we ever agree that we were going to change these over to here? What do you guys reckon? Let me know in the comments below. Do you think we should change over to these steel ones here? We know it only takes steel to repair them now. Do we think this is going to be enough? We've got these up to steel. Everything else is up to reinforced concrete. Hmm. Let me know in the comments down below. But that's where I'm going to leave it. As always, big thumbs up on the video if you've enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought about the end of Dishong Tower. And until we see you next time, take it easy, guys. See you later.